Hi, this is a little dwarf playing games while rambling this incoherently no into a microphone. Why? Well, just because I can, and I continue with Deus Ex Mankind Divided Blind. Now, I am here in the Prague sewers trying to uh, find a contact from the Samistad underground newspaper who seem to be uh, working on blowing the cover of the task force. Okay, can't really. Hmm. Although, you know what? The rebreather might be kind of useful for exploring, and I have three practice kits, which is enough to buy it. So, maybe I'll just do it. And be done with it. Now, what would, what would I do with the last one? I guess I can just buy Hacking 5 and be done with that as well. Hacking is always useful, generally speaking, I would say. Might might buy those two as well, not necessarily to turn the turrets and the bots against uh, the enemies, but just to disable them. I've neglected that in Human Revolution for a, for a really, really long time, and it was sometimes difficult for me later on because of that. So, um, with that being said, now I should be able to descend down here, although it will still sap my power rather quickly, so I should perhaps find a way to disable the gas or, or like filter it. Mm, Jessica something. Am I still getting drained while, when I'm when I'm reading that? Uh, chi chimera or nanovirus? It, it was some kind of a lab. Can I shut it down? Uh, wouldn't... Damn it. Because I'm not in the best position here, to be honest. Uh, Generally speaking. Okay, how do I even get back up? Okay, I'm go going to die soon, uh, regardless. How do I. Is there a ladder? I don't see anything. Mm, I thought I, I could maybe turn some valves and stop it. Uh, okay, I'm going to die. <laughs> well, at the very least I should read the freaking email, shouldn't I? So that something comes out of this. Verse alive. Uh, maybe there's also Neuropocene down there that I didn't, didn't notice. From my guests, exclusivity, anonymity, security. These are the but I still feel like there should be a way to disable that, right? Ah, there's a valve up top. But how would I? Hmm. So maybe maybe the whole rebreather was pointless after all. But uh, it's still a uh, useful enough. Uh, you know, utility. Yeah, so I it was pretty pointless, all things considered, at least for this situation. But it, it might give me an advantage uh, later on, for example in combat, if I ever throw a mm, gas grenade myself, then I can uh, just run through it. Mm, data scan. So this was some kind of a laboratory. Didn't let them tear us apart. We are stronger together. 
arc. Remi reminder: this Friday, Friday, this Friday is fridge, fridge cleaning day. Remove perishable food items. What? What does it have to do with anything in such a location as this one? Anyway, painkillers. But I was mostly interested in that Versa life. Okay, yeah, apparently it isn't uh, Neuropozin. Mm, chemical elements. Yeah, so they were clearly working on something here, what with all of the gas and then analyzing some virus. Oh, tranquilizer. Okay, that's I'm definitely stealing that, at the very least. That's 20 rounds, that's, that's pretty huge. Uh, now, back to that. Material needed for the next stage just arrived. I'm going to take advantage of my vacation to attend a ta talk in Bremen. It could serve as a useful platform to bring further attention to the use university's despicable behavior. Um, the material is in storage locker courtyard of the Zelen apartment complex. It's locked, of course. So I'm not sure if if they were manufacturing some kind of a chemical weapon here, which would the gas would uh, sort of imply, or if they were searching something that already exists because they are questioning the origin of some virus here. Well, whichever way it goes, I'm glad I came here just because of the uh, of the rounds for the rifle alone, because there was 20 of them, which is huge. Hmm. This is locked, and apparently no way to... There isn't like a terminal or anything, so I'm assuming it is locked until I progress to a certain part of the story. Sorry, Naomi Mangritsky. Do not kill me. I have a family. Hmm, so there's like a full blown homeless community here. Go away! I'm telling you. You're too clean to be one of them. My brother believes in fairy tales. Leave us alone. I'm telling you, I hear whispers in the wall. They speak the truth. You sure it's not in your head, brother? Shh! Beep, beep, clack, clack, typing, computers, don't you hear it? I don't hear anything. Hmm. Shh! Just listen. I've seen them go in and out. Well, this might very well be true, like, the, the, there was obviously uh, uh, some kind of a uh, research facility or something right next door, so there might be others rise up. That looks kind of like Jensen, although his face is obscured. Busy, leave me alone. Hmm. Movable metal crate. Hmm. Go away. Just hold out. You can do it. Okay, now. Freak. Hmm, that was unfortunate. Although, I could have sworn I purchased the uh, Icarus landing system, but apparently I didn't. Freak. So 
I need to get to the other side of this, don't I? Okay, I'm really not not good at getting across. Okay, now this should take me here. So yeah. I won't tell anyone what I know. <laughs> they wouldn't believe me anyway. You look nice and healthy. You getting your doses, eh, Ranch? I guess it pays to play with the man. I like it down here. If you don't, then you can just fuck off. You just wait. When they take your license, when you're tossed on the scrap heap, you'll find out just how bad it can get. Okay, there's a hole in the wall here, but you can do this. Quite sure. Oh, there's an, he's unconscious, not dead. Come over to my place in the Daphne district. I'll fix you up. I have a storage in the court courtyard. all the time the posy the posy would be in your opposite right why won't it stop it's telling me to do things bad things Do you consent? You consent? Do you consent? Do you consent? Do you consent? Okay, I'm kind of s disturbed by the implications of that question, which I guess is the point. Uh, So this this goes all the way back here, so hmm. So what's the deal with the consent? Can't go anywhere here. It's supposedly somewhere over here though. In this big room. So I've talked with the people here and... Hmm, is that person dead? Ah, he's still moving, so... I'd assume no. I've talked with the people down there and everything and... haven't really found anything. I still think we should lead with the moon base. to reason with them if possible. I wonder if they are going to attack me if I jump down, because I would very much like to talk to them if possible uh, before doing that. 
either way, either uh, in the, in um, otherwise, that's the word I was looking for. I will have to probably beat them up and then like delete the records or something. But they would still know that the front is the front. So I, as I said, I'll try talking. Don't shoot. Shit. We're journalists. Who invited the agent type? Who are you? What do you want? Why are you here? You, you here because of the Dubai story? Or the article about the moon base? The, 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 the clones, the, the clones on the moon base, who sent you? <laughs> I'm here for Sam as dad. You in charge? I take charge, but I'm not in charge, man. No one owns or detects the truth. Freedom of information is a collective right, man, and the, and the collective responsibility. That said, you gonna break someone's nose, you break my nose. Hmm. Yeah, I, I do. I don't want to beat them up. I didn't come here to break anything. I just need you to cooperate. I spent my 20s in a commune, man. I'm all about cooperation. Good. It's about something you've been looking into. It's making some people nervous. What do you know about Praha Dovos? Well, that little import company? I know there's more than boxes in the basement. We've seen agent types come in and out. The place is a curtain. The first in a series of men. Pull them all back and you'll find them. Tell me I'm wrong. It's a dead end. <laughs> right. Guys like you always come down here because of dead ends. Fine. Then what if it's something other people are already looking into? If someone like you makes too much noise, that may compromise any chance they have of uncovering something bigger. Do you understand? <laughs> I'm supposed to believe we're colleagues now? Two men in black types you walk into Pike's newsroom, tell them to be hush-hush about something, and they do it. But that's not how it works here. One day, you will all be exposed. If not by me, then someone just like me. Sam is that isn't one voice. K isn't one man. What exactly do you do down here? Sami's death is a media uprising. While Pikes panders to corporate tyranny and government bullshit, we pump out the truth. We uncover it, we write it, we publish it. We get our noses broke for it. So you print pamphlets? Well, we do a lot more than that. We got ways of getting into Pikes media network. That's how we disseminate information. Information you get by hacking into places you shouldn't. The truth is buried. If digging it up means skirting a few rules, so be it. What did you mean when you said K wasn't one man? K is an ideal, the intangible leader of tangible resistance. You can kill me, but then little K would become K. Kill little K and, and Bones over there becomes K. That's, there's always a K. And what if you kill Bones? <laughs> you can't kill Bones, man. Bones isn't real. I think he was one of them. He was supposed to be a prince of Belgium, man, but then he broke his condition. We found him inside this fucking cult, all confused, so we reprogrammed him with the truth. Right. What, what? Suppose I needed to make a deal with Sam as dad. There's no one person I can talk to? Depends on the deal. I mean, there's always going to be an editor. Editor makes the final call on all published material. That would be me. So you could ensure that something doesn't get talked about? Depends on the deal. I need you to stop looking into Prahadovos, but not for the reason you assume. Relax, I get it. You don't think I do, but I do. You've got to appease your military industrial masters. You've all been there, man. I'm not who you think I am. The kinds of people who manipulate the news, who cover things up. You don't need to convince me that's who the enemy is. The enemy is anyone who conceals the truth. And that's exactly what you're asking me to do. To pretend like that little import company isn't hiding something. I'm asking you to see a difference between conspiracy and discretion. Between people who hide information in order to push their own agendas and those who need to stay off the radar in order to do their jobs. You of all people should understand. Okay. Okay, look. You seem like a reasonable guy, huh? Hell, I've usually been punched by now. I find this refreshing. Here's the deal. 
we promise to forget all about Praha the Lost and stay out of your way as long as you give us something back. What do you suggest? The only thing I hate more than secret organizations are toothless media conglomerates who don't hold anyone accountable, who spit lie after lie after lie. So I propose a trade. There are places my people can't get into. You get into one of those places and find me some dirt on the real enemy here. Pikes Media. Do that, and I'll cut whatever you want me to cut. Who knows? Maybe you'll even learn something. Uh, to be honest, it said it said it says it says that persuade. Uh, but to be honest, I have nothing. I'm going to try it. Is it like a variation on the pheromones or something from Human Revolution? But to be honest, I don't have anything against. Uh, Digging up dirt on Pikes because after all, Pikes is Illuminati controlled, so I count them among my enemies anyway. But I'm curious about this option, so let me. You're gonna forget everything you know about Praha Dovots for now. It's the only way you get to protect your ideals. <laughs> right, because concealing information is obviously the best way to keep people informed. You really think I'm that stupid? There's this word you might want to look up, it's called transparency. It means people have the right to know, no matter what the cost. Manic, paranoid, idealistic. Dedication to truth, truth verges on obsession. Mm. Fear and extremist trust of authority are likely to be well founded. He, he, I doubt he's uh, susceptible to being like he could be intimid intimidated for a moment, but his overall dedication to uncovering the truth. I feel like I need to convince him and not not frighten him. Mm. Okay, this seems like a good enough response. Fair enough, but there's a difference between speculation and fact. Right now I'm betting you don't have anything tangible to go on. You don't know who I am, what my role is, or what's really going on. Wait until the facts are out before you go spewing misinformation everywhere. Before you get people killed. Okay, maybe I don't have all the facts yet, I'll give you that, but I know something's going on down there. Otherwise you wouldn't be here. That's why you always have to keep digging. The truth, the real truth. It's a rare fucking bird, man. And if you're too slow or too careful, it fucking flies off. So when I get so much as a hint of truth, I strike when I can, as hard as I can. Again, frightening him, I doubt is going to yield the best results. Mm. Again, this is, seems to be a good enough response uh, with trying to appeal to the fact that he has nothing but conjecture at this point. Whatever the cost, is that it? You want to be better than Pikus, right? So what does Pikus do? They frighten people. They sensationalize the news, they misdirect. If you want to resist them, you need to strive to be objective. You need to deal in truths. And the truth is, putting Braha Dovos under the spotlight right now is dangerous to me and useless to the public. Wait until it's time. Okay, okay, I get it. I don't want to compromise no one's investigative journalism. Uh, sometimes you move too fast and the real story flies off before you even had a chance to see it. That's not what we do here. So you go break open whatever it is you're breaking open, and we'll lay off Praha the Vos. For now. You're making the right choice. We'll see. You know, we could still use your help, though. Journalistic integrity may not mean very much topside, but it still means something down here. And that's why I think you should help us. You're our best shot at hitting the mass media where it hurts. Yeah, as I said, I have nothing against... Uh... Mm, digging up dirt on Pikus, so... Alright, what do you want to know about Pikus? 
I want skeletons, the kind that companies like Pikes come all the way to Prague just to bury. Corporate archiving, man. Corporate archiving, huh? You asking me to break the <laughs> bank? I'm not talking vaults here. Ashani Talvar, the Palisade CEO. She leverages her clients, keeps information about them close at hand. She's got something on Pikes, I know it. I just can't get to it, but I bet you could. You poke into her office, find something that proves how nasty Pikes is, how much they love to piss on the truth, and I promise you this, I'll misplace any file you want. We'll see. Chad, you there? What do you got for me? Took care of Sam as dad. No one's going to be reading anything about us anytime soon. Oh, I'll cancel the movers. How'd you do it? I've reasoned with them. They're not going to give us any trouble. Reasoned? With the conspiracy nuts. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> do I, though? Uh, well, I'll talk with the others as well. I still think we should lead with more. I finally got through to my contact in the trade office. He, uh, he says to fuck off. Keep trying, Bond. Keep giving them help. Think of us as counterculture patriots. Our mission? To inform people. To offer an alternative to Pikas. Okay. Mm, another one of those strange boards with adjectives on it. I still don't get it. Photos. Coffee machine. Well, I think I'm actually done here for the moment. Hmm. But what did that accomplish, really? I can't move this because I'm not strong enough. Ah, so there was a way to move through here the entire time, I just didn't notice it. Well, another point for the game, I guess. Mm, now, what are my objectives, the side objectives? Mm, I have only one. Dig up the dirt in CEO's office in Palisade. Okay, so... I am going to do that. Because I don't want to proceed with the main mission too far, too quickly, because it might uh, make the side missions obsolete. I've lived in Prague my whole life. Never seen it this bad. Even before the economic reforms. Sorry. Okay, now Palisade was on a totally other side of the district. You can get all of this and more tonight in the red light. I know what you're thinking. It's probably really expensive. And it is, but it's the experience of a lifetime, friend. Don't hesitate, don't think. When has that ever worked out for anybody? Just get in there and follow your instincts. Don't thank me in the morning, friend. Wait, did that person just appear out of thin air? That's kind of what it kind of what it looked like, but I guess it's more of a technical limitation than something that uh, I'm supposed to take as part of the world of the game. Nothing suspicious here. Wells will take care of it. Hmm, I'm having a sudden spike of lag. Which, I'm not going to lie, is kind of weird and annoying. Ok, 
Okay, see, it seems I left my email open again, which is kind of annoying because uh, you, you, you can probably hear the notification on the recording as well, so I think I'm going to uh, pause for a second to close it, but first let me get to the bank. Okay, so be right back. Okay, I'm back. So, hmm, how to best approach? Well, I guess first I need to locate where her office is. Uh, Thomas Romanek. It's not it. Daniel Janicek. <laughs> Executive boardroom. This seems to be freely, av freely available, which is weird. Actually. That horrible day two years ago with augmented people all over Okay if flew into a psychotic I've uh, read that issue already. Pocket secretary. Don't mind if I do. Mm. Ivana Drahos. I apologize for not telling you sooner. Uh, new code to the office. Uh, okay, but it's not the person... How, how's the director called again? Mm. Ashani Telvar. Security. Okay, this is the corporate vault, which I don't need to go to at the moment. Mm. Security is our main concern at Palisade. <coughs> mm, elevator. Welcome to Palisade. We get few augmented clients to visit us, sir. Okay, Palisade Executive lock, uh, Locker Key, Security, this is all restricted, but I... Executive Safes, that's also not what I need. I literally need an office, uh, but I'm not sure where to find it. Level 1, uh, Level 3 Office is restricted, so presumably I can't even... Mm, call the elevator to go there, right? Yeah, because I don't have mm, executive services. Mm, so how would I get to there? That is the question. Now, I have a code to someone's office. Uh, it is not, not this though, executive services. I'm not sure what this would avail me. Because um, basically I need like a key card or something, uh, so that I can uh, use it on the elevator to get me to the offices in the first place, because the whole floor is restricted. Elevator. Hmm. It's weird that the security doesn't react. No worries whatsoever. The whole building exudes a sense of, of fortification. You know <laughs> what I mean? Absolutely. I've had my and my company's valuables in here since Palisade first opened its doors. And my confidence in their security has only grown. You have a corporate vault? I've heard incredible rumors about the sub-basement. <clears throat> oh, no, no. We're a small company. A safe in the executive vaults is all we need. Or can afford, to be honest. I must admit, the rates here are quite high. I agree. <laughs> However, you can't really put a price on peace of mind, can you? It was lovely meeting you. And you. Goodbye. 
Well, I haven't seen someone augmented in here in no. well since the incident. I'm kind of weirded out by the fact that I attempt to hack all of, well, I guess I'm not attempting to hack it, I'm just, uh, I'm just looking at it, so I guess it might, might not technically be illegal. Uh, Palisade elevator keycard, okay, that's exactly what I needed. Uh, pocket secretary, that's also potentially useful. Thomas Romanek. Mm, reviewing security gaps, gaps created by Bartosz and Julian before we fired them. Completely poor report forthcoming. Issues are very serious. Most sensitive material should be stored in the bank's SDB in room A. The code is something. Uh, SDB room? No. Oh, is, is that on a map? SDB. Wait, really? It has nine levels. And I guess most of them go down. Mm. SDB. Executive saves. Mm. Executive services. SDB. See, IT services. Well, I don't care about the lower levels for now. I need to get into the offices. Which actually might be a decent time to upgrade my cloak to reduce its uh, its power uh, use, and this way it will allow me to it will allow me to <laughs> interesting can knock people out while still unconscious. But basically, it will allow me to use the cloak for longer periods of time. Uh, in case I need it on the upper floor. Okay, so this is IT services. I might have to knock some of those people out, actually, so that they don't raise the alarm. Because... Okay, I can't get out of here, to be honest, for now. Because if they keep running free, then at some point, you know, I'm pretty crappy at the whole stealth thing, so at some point, freak. He says, at some point they are going to see me, just as they see him. Uh, but yeah, basically, I probably should uh, take at least some of them out. Oh, level 3 offices. Maybe I can... Okay, that doesn't exactly work the way I would like it to, but... I guess it worked well enough, considering the circumstances. This is the back of the elevator, right? Yeah, but I think I would need an Icarus landing system to get down there. Let me check where this leads. Does it lead to the lower exiting restricted zone? Yeah, I think this, this leads to the uh, lower level altogether, which isn't particularly and so so would that right so that isn't particularly helpful to be honest and this is the top of the elevator itself which again doesn't necessarily help me that much hmm but there's another another vent on the other side which might be useful. 
Vent cover. Okay, so this goes to some kind of a lobby, which again I'm not, I'm not entirely comfortable with. Okay, I'll try to... let me orientate myself. Sito's office. And presumably there's another way than just going uh, Ashani Talwar. Another way than just going straight in, but I might try it anyway. Activate the cloak, then run here. And now... Free. Um, okay, that's. That's, n <laughs> that's, n <laughs> that's, n that's not exactly what I wanted to accomplish here. Yeah, I think there's no point. I think there's little point trying to fight them all. Code uh, zero. But the gen general idea was good enough, I guess, it's just the execution that was woefully lacking. So basically... Leaving post might have something. Keep it down. Hmm... It was nothing. There's a camera up there, but maybe I can hack uh, the door quick enough, because I'm pretty sure this should lead to the CEO's office. Mm. Maybe I can hack it quick enough so that it doesn't notice me, or otherwise stand uh, underneath it. Although I, I think this particular model, as opposed to the Human Revolution one, can actually see uh, like right underneath itself. So... That might not necessarily be as helpful as I would have liked. So let's enable that. Whoa, okay, that's freak. I probably should uh, auto hack this. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Wait, where's the where's the last part I need? Okay, I, I think I barely did it somehow. Right uh, now. Close the door. Close the door. Okay, I think I, I can't close the door, but But still, it seems there's nobody here. So, newspaper, uh, read that already. I feel uneasy with the door being opened because obviously, uh, if we were to treat this, okay, that's not her. But, but still, it might be useful in and of itself. Man, those systems are rather complicated. Anomaly detected. Trace program 
initiated. Frick, I fortified the wrong thing, but I still might be able to. Access granted. Yeah, it's always a little, little bit frantic. Uh, high priority, effective immediately. Bartosz Włodek has taken a sudden extended leave of absence. We wish him best and looking forward to his eventual return. The task of executive service managers will be handled internally. Uh, I think this guy is Polish actually. He's both the, the exact spelling of his uh, first name and the, his, sec his uh, surname a little bit as well. Mm, kind of suggests that. Yeah, I feel a little bit uneasy about the door being open because obviously if you were to treat this situation uh, realistically, then um, then they would obviously notice that something is wrong. Uh, drinking water, analysis results, what? Uh, a recent investigation confirms that the last week's chemical spill in fact gotten into the city's water supply. As you all know, it's the policy of this news test to refrain from inciting public panic unless it serves a higher purpose. We will not be publishing this information at a time. The only thing worse than a sick population is a hysterical one. Uh, until everything is resolved, it is highly recommended that you and your family stay vigilant. Do not use the city's water supply to drink, bathe, wash your dishes. Okay, so I think this is enough dirt because obviously not only are they not reporting on it they are specifically warning their own employees to keep away from the water mm. whereas normal people have no idea that anything is even wrong uh, okay I want to hack okay this is the CEO's computer Okay, I might be screwed here, although the timer is rather long, so... Access granted. Mm, security concerns. Madame, from Picus. Um, in separate response to your recent concerns, uh, the Palisade Property Bank Oh no, 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 two pikers from uh, the CEO mm. takes the feedback of its clients very seriously, especially one of your standing. External allegations that our security is compromised are presently false. I have no reason to suspect these malicious rumors were merely started. I have reason to suspect these rumors were started by startup competitors desperate to undermine our position. Mm, okay. Vodek problem. Uh, I've had someone look into our friend Bartosz. It seems this isn't the only thing he's been looking into on was divulging to the public. Quite an underground persona on some anarchist side. Mm, I don't think we have any choice but to let him go. I'll have a private word with him before we leave. You should send out a carefully worded message to the other employees. Mm. Might have a problem. Have you authorized him to look into our automated systems? This seems well outside his purview as executive service manager. And that stupid sculpture. I'm sure the designer tell the designer you love her work. Just remember that you were the muse. What was it I told her? I asked the concept of two holes complementing the hall. When one fits the other, harmony is attained, and so on. Joking aside, don't tell the 
didn't they tell you how to solve it already? RTR, TTR. Uh, you said you'd be okay remembering that. Ah, so it presumably opened some kind of a hidden passage. You, were your, you and your overly complicated block sculpture thingy. It took nearly 10 minutes of turning and poking before I found the right combination. Uh, such things only annoy me, plus I can't stand that modern art garbage. Mm, yeah, presumably it opens some kind of a secret passage in this office because uh, there is a Oh, wait, 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 how do I... I didn't... I didn't want to turn... Can I reset it? Because... Freak. Because I clicked it sort of without looking at it first. And obviously I need to follow... I thought it, it is going to bring up the, the... The method of solving it. Uh, so it would be... I know rotate, R would be rotate, or T, but but T could also be turn, and raise maybe 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 raise and turn, raise turn raise, turn turn raise, raise turn raise, so raise, turn, freak, I did it wrong, can I turn it back? Okay, I screwed it completely now, so I'm not sure. Race, turn, race, uh, turn, but, 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 but it's not going to fit anymore because, yeah, because I've screwed it, so... Trick. It's not what I, what I wanted to do actually, but those two are, I think, good. So I need to. Oh, but it equalized them. Yeah, that's that's a problem actually, because I could have had it solved already. Uh, if I just. If I just didn't touch it in the first place. Yeah, because this... Uh, is there a way to, like, reset it? Okay, what does this do? Okay, that, that was really unwise. Uh, freak. Okay, I'm kind of annoyed at myself right now. <laughs>
Okay, I have. <laughs> I, I, w <laughs> I, I wasn't really trying to do that. I was trying to do something else um, and refer back to uh, the, the, the this. I was trying to like reset it and re refer back to this. <laughs> but <laughs> well, I don't really know. Like, I, I fully admit I did that by accident. Uh, I wasn't planning on solving this uh, yet. I was trying to do something else, but... Oh well, I guess I'll take it. After the previous embar embarrassing couple minutes. Uh, so, I think this episode has been long enough. I'll check what's in this storage next time. For now, that's all for this one. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!